Today I've walked over to the northern end of Great Clue Street in Salford. The last 150 metres of the very northern end of this road, which ran close to the River Irwell, suffered from several landslides between 1880 and 1927, with a major landslide in 1927 resulting in the left side of the road falling away entirely, and so the northern end of the road has been closed off ever since, with the right pavement becoming a passageway leading to Berry New Road, the original end of Great Clue Street. The main road part of Great Clue Street now ends at Knoll Street, which buses now use to access Berry New Road, meaning the penultimate 150 metres or so of the road has lost its main road status. As a result, it was never really modernised, and is still cobbled to this day. Of particular interest to me is, of course, the very visible traces of the old tram line that ran up Great Clue Street. Along the penultimate 150 metres of the road, the tram tracks themselves are not visible, though you can clearly see their path from the straight lines in the cobbles. The best street, however, is right at the current end of the road, at the corner of Great Clue Street and Lower Broughton Road, where this small bit of original tramway still exists out in the open. I then decided to walk up the 150 metre passageway to Berry New Road, once the right pavement of Great Clue Street. You can clearly see the former edge of the pavement on the left side of the passage. in the fence you can walk along the hillside towards the River Irwell and look up at the half-collapsed road. If you look carefully, you can see the edge of the former cobbled street bending down like a waterfall frozen in time. That's about all there is to see. The sad thing is, there isn't a plaque or anything around here. Everything I know about this landslide is from the internet, and this little piece of local history is relatively obscure and unknown. I only found out about it by accidentally stumbling across a picture of it on a Wikipedia article. So if you're interested in local history or trams or both and happen to be around North Manchester, I would highly recommend popping over to take a look at this brilliant bit of local history, a road frozen in time. On that same Wikipedia article, by the way, I saw a picture of a tiny bit of tramway on Lever Street, near Piccadilly Gardens right in the centre of Manchester, which had been exposed by a pothole. I decided to go have a look, and lo and behold, there it was. Thank you for watching and please subscribe. If you happen to know of any other tiny traces of Manchester's former tram system, do let me know.